Okay, so this is going to be my very quick put together video on how to attach a sash to a dress. I've only done dresses that have flat fronts that are fitted, so I haven't done this to a peasant dress. I don't know why it wouldn't work, but I haven't really thought about it that much, so don't quote me please. Um, so this is the, my fitted bodice, pretend, my pretend sash. I'm going to take my sash, fold it in half, and I'm going to lay it on top of my bodice with the middle of the sash, meaning the middle of the bodice. And then I'm going to cut off the two sides so that the sash is the same size as the bodice. The most important part is to get your sash lined up above your seam allowance. You don't want to sew your sash into your skirt when you sew your bodice and your skirt together. So sew it right above the seam allowance. You don't want to get it too high either because then you'll have bodice sticking out in between the sash and the skirt. So you want to get it right above the seam allowance. Once you figure out what that is, attach it at the bottom and attach it at the top. Once it's completely sewn on and in your pattern you're ready to sew the bodice together, you're going to get the two side sashes or back sashes. Lay them directly on top so that you know everything's even. And you're going to sandwich them between the front and the back bodice. So let's pretend to sew my back bodice on. I'm just going to pin to save time. So I would have sewn my front and back together. Open it up. And now that sash part is attached in the side seam, but it's not attached on the back so that you can tie it in a bow and untie it as needed. And it's going to look the same on the side, on the other side. And that's how I attach my sash onto my dress before I set the dress together and not after, so it's a lot easier this way, I believe. Um, if you have any questions, just let me know. Thanks.